Hey everybody, back here with another episode of Carb Smashers. We're smashing some carbs here in the Carb Smasher kitchen. How is everybody out there today? Hope you're doing well. Today's a good day. Got our workout done. Got up early. Tonight's a work night. We got to go in about midnight. We get something to eat and then in about three or four hours probably turn in for a good nap before we go to work. So what we got going today is we're doing hot dogs again. We did conies before. Today we're doing a little different take on them. We're going to try to do like a carnival style dog today. We got some uh, some relish we're going to put on them, which has zero carbs. We got some good old yellow mustard we're going to use. I'm going to use this for Cat uh, when I make hers. These two I'm doing just for me. She ain't quite ready to eat yet. She's in the shower getting ready. For me, I'm going to use this Kroger Spicy Brown Mustard. It has no carbs as well. So we got the Kroger Brown Mustard going in. We got some relish going in. We're going to have a little carb in our diced onions. And my secret ingredient today is really no secret, but I'm going to fry some kraut in there. Kraut loves some sauerkraut. Now these have one total carb minus fiber is zero net carbs so zero net carbs zero net carbs maybe one net carb or two between the two dogs and we actually have some good looking hot dog buns today these are from you probably guessed it Aunt Millie's Live Carb Smart I was out of them when I did the Coney version these come in at three net carbs per bun. So they have uh, 19 grams of carb minus 16. They have some soluble and insoluble fiber and I think I might have been wrong on one of my other videos. I don't think I can take off the soluble or insoluble fiber. So uh, we're just going to go 19 minus 6 and say we got three net carbs in each roll. So we're going to be coming in at 6. We're using our good Kogels which uh, they, they're, they're considered less than one. So if I say these are three quarters, so that's six, that'll be seven and a half. We'll have maybe eight and a half or nine. And was there some other carb I'm forgetting? No, mustard's none, relish's none, kraut's none. So six, we got seven and a half. Maybe, say nine, nine grams of net carbs bacon grease going here. A little more than I needed, but oh well, they'll fry up good. Good and hot. Ooh, they ain't going to take them long. Anyway, my dogs are looking pretty good. They're starting to bust apart a little. They're getting good and blackened up. So I'm going to pull them off. So I have to go crazy with the kraut. No carbs. Figured out this whole bowl has uh, four four cards I believe it was. So we'll have an exact count. We'll put a little onion in there. Alright, so we're finishing up here a little bit. I'm gonna steam my buns a little. Get those steaming. It'll take a second or two to get those good and steaming. Power down. Oh, ooh, good and steamy here. Maybe one with brown mustard and one with yellow mustard. What the heck, huh? Got one with yellow. One brown. Got a little relish coming in here. Dog. You have it, as my buddy Dave at second base has it. I guess you could call this a good old dog. If you out there, Dave. Let me hot bite. All right, so we let them cool down a little bit. And I'm gonna go with another little sprinkle of raw onion on top. A little more yellow on the yellow. See, I'm gonna try to brown one here. 
Oh, that looks good though, doesn't it? One of these, right here, we got uh, three grams in the bun, less than one in the hot dog, maybe one and a quarter in the onion. So we got three, say four, five, maybe five net carbs in this whole little meal. And if you eat both of them, like I probably will, it'll be about 10 grams for the day. If this is your first or second meal, if you're trying to get into ketosis and uh, stay under 20, You'll get there. Looking good. Bon appetit. Mm -hmm. Feel like I've been in a carnival or a fair. Polish sausage. You do the same thing. You put a Polish sausage in it. You just like the carnival. Hey, until next time, please like, subscribe, tell your friends. Anything you can do to help us out, appreciate it. If you like making these videos, 